Hi, it's the Brooker That Gratitude Guy. Today, comparison is the thief of joy. I heard that from somebody here several weeks ago and I thought, not only is comparison the thief of joy, but it's also the thief of gratitude. I talk so much about gratitude and how we want to reframe and refocus everything that we have in our life that we're grateful for and not what we worry about what we don't have. And I thought of a couple examples recently about how somebody said as well, never compare your inside to somebody else's outside. This whole comparison thing is the thief of joy and it'll take away the joy in your life. And I think so many people are looking for joy and happiness and trying to have fulfilling lives. I recently was with some folks and we were playing golf and I, I could tell this guy wasn't giving us a legitimate score. And I go, uh, he says, what did you get? And he goes, a six. And I thought, I don't even think you're on the green till seven. But the point is, who cheats at golf? Aren't you kind of playing against yourself? I want to be as best as I can be, as best as I can be. I want to do it as well as I can do. Our local team, the Seahawks and Coach Carroll, they talked about this throughout the years. They drove their way to the Super Bowl. This people always say, what about this team? What about that team? And the whole philosophy from the Seahawks and Coach Pete Carroll and everyone was, let's just be the best we can be. Let's not worry so much about the comparison to this team. So think about that and use gratitude. Use gratitude. Use a gratitude journal. Be the best you can be. You will continually focus on everything you have in your life versus what you don't have. This comparison thing is a fool's game and it is a thief of joy and it is a thief of gratitude and many, many other things that make us happy. So if you want to be happy, if you want to be joyful, be grateful. Write in a gratitude journal. Focus every single day on everything you have versus what you don't have. Believe me, it'll make a huge difference. That's the message for today. Have a grateful day. We'll see you tomorrow.